Hey everyone, this is Heather. And this is Nathan. With Game of Penguin. And I am so excited. It is time for wave four of the Harry Potter Funko Pops to be released. And this is the very first one that I have picked up. And it is a Hot Topic exclusive. And it is Lupin after he has turned into a werewolf. And this is number 49 in the Harry Potter series. And I am so excited for this new wave. So here's the artwork on the back. Here's the box from the side. Number 49. So these are some of the new ones that you can get. Um, Harry with the Marauder's Map. Hermione with the Time Turner. Uh, Ron holding Scabbers. Um, the regular Remus as a human. Yay, finally a Jenny. How long have we been waiting for a Jenny pop? So Jenny in her school uniform. Um, Luna with the lion head, which I cannot wait to get. And Peter Pettigrew. And isn't this going to be one of the biggest waves yet? There will be a total of 10 in addition to the ones on the back of the box. Um, there's this Hot Topic exclusive, a Barnes & Noble exclusive with Jenny and her Quidditch outfit, and then one from a company called Boxed Lunch, which I think, I'm not 100% sure, I think it's like an offshoot of Hot Topic, and that one is Harry with his um, Firebolt broom. So I'm on currently on the hunt for all of these. They're just kind of starting to hit the internet and hitting uh, stores in our area, but I found out that our Hot Topic had gotten the exclusive, and so we rushed over to grab it, and I'm so excited. I love Lupin. He is one of my favorite characters from the books and the movies, so I'm really excited to get the Lupin Pops. And the first thing we've gotten used to checking out is the stand. Stand, and there is a stand. <laughs> Good, because he looks like his little scrawny body yeah. is... Uh, Which is kind of accurate the to the movie. He, oh, very, yeah. He was a yeah. weird proportion. Yeah, he had a very large head and a very small body. Let's out of the way, so... Oh, uh, wow, he's cool. really cool. So he's got kind of a... Almost a neon green, bright green eyes. I'm thinking pea and soup green. Yeah, they are, yeah, they are kind of pea soup green. Got really big, almost bat-like ears. Got some nice texture. Some texture on top of his head. Got a nice snout and his teeth are snarling. So he's got his really kind of long proportion of his hands and feet. And he's sort of in there's a, even kind detail of a on his rib cage. Like, look at it. Oh, there is. Yeah. Yeah, and there's a lot of detail on that rib cage there. Wow. That's pretty sweet. Yeah. They're getting good about adding, I like the brow too, about adding so much great detail. So here he is from the back. Oh, he's cool. I like the profile a lot. I think he's got a really great profile. So let's get him on his stand here. Sometimes they're easy to go on, and sometimes they're not. Let's see if I can pop that. There we go. There, it kind of clicked into place. Cool. Nice. He is really... Even with his stand, he's a little wobbly. Yeah. Well, I think maybe our, our yeah. area here is not that flat. So he's really awesome. The only thing, I kind of wish he had been flocked. I think this would have been a really... Uh, interesting Yeah, one. he would have been a really yes. good one um, to release flocked. But he is really, really sweet. I'm very happy with him. I think he looks a lot like he looks in the films. And here again is his box. So, once again, this is Harry Potter number 49. Yep. It is Remus, <laughs> Remus Lupin as a werewolf. And he is a Hot Topic exclusive. I have not seen him show up on the website yet. But um, we picked him up in our stores and... They had sold a bunch, and I've heard online people are saying they're going really fast. So if you see it in store and you're thinking about it, I would go ahead and, and pick it up because I think this one's going to be really popular and 49. it's going to go really quick. So Awesome. Well, do you have anything else, Dad? No, I, I, I'm kind of so cool. It's cool to see uh, these coming out. 
Uh, we got a couple more pop videos. There's a couple I'm trying to find, so I can't wait to get some of my own pop videos up. But yeah. it's going to be really cool to see some of that. And we promise we will still get the Wave 1, Wave 2 total collection video shot. Yeah, we yeah, it's it, uh, probably maybe after I get everything from yes. from this fourth wave, the boxed lunch exclusive looks like that's going to be the hardest one to track down. It's sold out online right now. I hope that they're going to restock cuz I'm going to be really sad if I can't be a completist. Well, to, get to, all to be of fair, them. almost all of the uh all of the exclusives show up everywhere within 3 or 4 months. Uh exclusivity oh. about <clears throat> Two out of three is usually just a temporary thing. Oh. These will be showing up in your Walmarts. <laughs> Not the exclusives, though. No, some of them do. Remember, there's a couple that we got as exclusives that showed up yeah, like six months I later. I don't know. Some of the, a lot of these down. I hope so. Yeah, that would be yes. awesome, especially since box lunch Especially box lunch is, lunch is a, not a, yeah. Yeah, there's only a, a, you know, kind of a handful around the country. We but already anyway, suffer we enough <laughs> because yeah. we don't live on the West Coast. So. Yeah, it takes forever to <laughs> stop. So uh, be sure to check back soon because as soon as these others in the fourth wave of Harry Potter start rolling in, I will be snagging them and we will put them up so you can take a closer look at them as always we appreciate you guys taking the time to check out your videos we know that you clearly are the biggest fans of our harry potter stuff and yeah. we are so happy to be able to bring it up and show it to you guys so please enjoy and share thanks for joining us today this is heather this is nathan have a magical day have a great one bye, bye.